Boot up, people. It's competition time. Okay, you and tension is mounting. Shaky start. We're in Finland at the top of Northern Europe. Finland, aka the land of a thousand lakes, is extremely wacky. They hold competitions here to see who can sit on live anthills the longest. Ouch. Our first stop is Helsinki, where we'll be checking out more of the wacky local culture. We're on track of the whack in Finland, a country crammed with craziness. Hi, did you know Santa lives here in Lapland in the far north and he gets thousands of letters every year? You heard it here first. Finland is home to a lot of wacky things, including boot throwing competitions. Yeah, and we love a little bit of competition, so we're going to give it a crack. Boot throwing is a serious sport here. Champions throw distances of 50 metres or more. Crazy! Six-time world champion Asta and her friend Aya are on hand to teach us how it's done. It's boot throwing boot camp. OK, so basically you've got to have a straight arm, throw over, and the recommended grip that Asta's given us is to have your thumb in the back side of a boot. That blue line as well, you're not allowed to cross it. I fear for everyone's safety right now. Oh, it's so big. So, Asa told me to holla when I throw. Ah! <laughs> yeah, that's so she knows when to duck. <laughs> oh, you did not yeah. step on the blue. Uh -huh. Foul. You can't touch. It's good distance, but it was a foul. Foul. Boot up, people. It's competition time. And tension is mounting. Are you on my team? No. One, two, three, boot. Yeah. And we're off. Yeah. My team versus Team Gilly going head to head and boot to boot. Oh! Shaky start. Ambo's team looking confident. Oh, but it's short-lived. Huh, referee! Looks like Team Gilly's making some kind of a boot Thanks. substitution. Is that allowed? Uh, so my grandpa's boot. Oh, All the way from Oz. Pop, if you're watching. Uh, sorry I didn't ask, but I knew you'd say no. <laughs> oh, an amazing throw! Oh, no, the ref's not happy. Oh, give me a chance, ref. It's a foul. Sorry, Pop, let you down. Typical Ambo, hoping she'll get points for screaming. <laughs> but it's the spectators screaming now. Yeah, mate, just um, just took out someone's car over there, so if you want to... <laughs> Trust the locals to put in a strong finish. Yes. yes, good distance. After all, it is a national sport here in Finland. The judges are now adding up each team member's best distance of the day to create an overall team score. And the winner is... Oh, no oh, way! No it's no Team no 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 Devastation. We're having a blast with the kids here in Helsinki. But they're about to introduce us to a darker side of Finnish culture. Oh, I don't like the look of this. It's would you rather time. OK, Samuel, what have you got? Hello, come up. So Samo and his friends have come up with two extremely gross challenges for us. Oh, rubbing sausages and mustard Ooh. in your hair. And uh, Consta, what have you got here for us? Oh! Oh, that is disgusting. What is it? Look at that. That is some great. <laughs> what is it? Mammy. What's mammy? <laughs> Mummy doesn't sound good. <laughs> mammy is a traditional Finnish dish eaten at Easter, which looks like. Well, you decide. Sausages and mustard are big on the menu here too, but not usually worn in your hair. Head or two? Yeah, yeah, get it, toss it for Two. It's a two! It's a two. Ooh, that That's means you've got to do it. So, which would you rather, a sausage and mustard hairdo or eat the gross-looking dare food? Well, the mummy actually looks like chocolate, so I reckon I'm going to give that a go. Yum. <laughs> It's not 
chocolate! You gotta eat it! Why do you make it look like chocolate if it's not chocolate? Okay then, let's get this over with. Sausage isn't gonna help. Oh, well done. Oh, well done. Done. Oh. Thank you very much. There you go. And good job. No. Bye bye. Okay. See you guys. See ya. Oh, God. Oh. <laughs>